back to Showstopper, powered by Equiratings. Well, the Longines Global Champions Tour is making its return to Miami Beach this week, and we thought we'd give you a rundown of some of the stats surrounding the spectacular event. One of the smallest arenas on the tour, it's located literally right on the beach in Miami. Waves even crash into the side of the arena during high tide. Warm-ups take place in the dark before sunrise, and European horses who attend the event must also travel to Mexico City the following week as they are quarantined in a bubble all the way from Europe to Miami, to Mexico, and back to Europe. They're also stabled separate from the local horses. Some overall numbers and stats from over the years include Typically, a field of 35 riders are qualified to participate in round one of the Grand Prix. The average clear rate in the Grand Prix is 22%. An average of only 5.7 riders make it into the jump off, with usually only three of those going double clear, equaling a jump off clear rate of 54%. Katrine Eckerman is the only rider to have won the LGCT of Miami twice consecutively. Edwina Topps is another two-time winner of the class. The 2019 LGZT Grand Prix of Miami Beach was won with the smallest win margin of 0.04 seconds. It is also the year that the most combinations managed to get through to the jump off with eight. And the 2018 edition had the lowest round one clear rate, 14%, while 2016 had the highest at 36%. Former winners also include Scott Brash, Hello Sanctos, Jerome Gary and Grand Cru, and Peter DeVos with Claire Z. It's bound to be an exciting week as horses and riders soak up the Florida sun and salt air, so make sure to check out the action this coming Thursday, Friday, and Saturday to see how this year's stats compare to years prior. And keep an eye out to see if defending champs Katrine Eckerman and Kalamandia can make it a hat trick with a third consecutive win. 